the Prince and Princess of Wales are set to offer a renewed image of the royal family during their trip overseas as the couple will offset the years of complaining from the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle relocated to America following their step down as senior royals in 2020 and have since embarked on a series of media ventures through their Archul non-profit organization. Royal commentator Kinsey Schofield has revealed Americans are excited to see Prince William and Kate as the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are not considered real royalty in the U.S. Speaking to GB News, Ms. Schofield reported, I think popularity-wise, you do see the Prince and Princess of Wales have a much stronger hold here in the United States. That was not always the case, we went through years of Harry and Meghan complaining. Ms. Schofield added, Americans are excited to see William and Catherine. For us, it's the first time we've seen real royalty in a very long time because I don't think that's how we define Harry and Meghan. During their trip to Boston, Prince William and Kate will attend the Earthshot Prize Award ceremony on December 2. The initiative was first launched in 2020 by Prince William to reward pioneers of sustainability and encourage optimism when facing environmental challenges. Discussing Prince William's charitable involvement, Ms. Schofield said, There is tangible change with William, he creates these initiatives where you see these results. She added, with Harry and Meghan, it's a lot of talk, it's a lot of complaining. Since their step back from the royal family, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex have stirred controversy with a series of media interviews alongside other independent ventures. In 2021, the couple gave a groundbreaking interview to Oprah Winfrey, during which they leveled serious accusations of racism against the royal family and claimed to have been let down by the institution. More recently, Meghan has launched her own podcast series, Archetypes, which aims to investigate, dissect and subvert the societal labels attached to women. Speaking of the podcast, Ms. Schofield said, podcasting about words you don't like, I really don't know what the ultimate objective is there. Additionally, Prince Harry's memoir is set to be published in January, with royal commentators speculating that the prince will make further damning allegations against the monarchy. Don't miss, despite Ms. Schofield's criticisms of Prince Harry and Meghan's complaining, the couple is set to be rewarded for their outspokenness. Just days after the Earthshot Prize ceremony concludes, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex will be handed the Ripple of Hope Award during a gala in New York City. The Robert F. Kennedy Human Rights Organization declared the couple would receive the award in recognition for their work surrounding racial justice, mental health and other social initiatives. The unprecedented Oprah Winfrey interview appears to have flung the couple into the spotlight on issues of racial justice as Carrie Kennedy, president of the nonprofit and daughter of Robert F. Kennedy, praised the couple for highlighting structural racism within the royal family. Read next.